Hello friends, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Alexis and tonight we're going to have a college night in my life getting everything I possibly can together sort of moment. A few months ago I moved into my first apartment at college with my roommates and honestly it's been so much fun. But I just got back from visiting home and my room is a disaster. There are literally bags everywhere of things I brought back from home. And I feel like my to-do list is like a million things high. Like I need to do like my weekly reset routine. I need to clean myself. I need to bake. I need to do my nails because I popped all my nails off and now they're crusty. So instead of doing this alone, not only for motivation for myself, but motivation for you, I thought it would be fun to do this together. So let's get started. But before that, let's do a rundown of all the objectives so we can meet these together. I need to unpack, do my laundry, I need to do my nails. As mentioned, I want to bake banana bread, I need to do my cleaning routine, and I want to do an everything shower and spa facial moment. After several hours and several detours, I finally finished like unpacking everything and I changed a few things around my room. And I really like how they turned out. So I want to give like a little like mini tour. So over here under my TV, I moved my books. So now my TBR books are up here and then the books I've read are down below. I finally updated my closet. So now these bins also have clothes in them and then workout gear and then my photography gear. And I think it makes my closet look so much more cohesive and organized. When I was home for the weekend, I also got this tote bag that I made, so I am so glad to finally get to hang it up on my door so I can actually use it. And then like the final step of all this is I need to go take this giant pile of trash from all my packages and stuff downstairs to the trash so I can start my cleaning routine. Okay, so cleaning my room is finally complete. This is a routine that I literally do every weekend. I usually do it on Sundays, but since I wasn't here, I wanted to do it today because it just helps me like keep this place clean enough that I don't need to be doing this like massive deep clean every couple months. It just keeps everything nice and tidy. And it really, really hurts my brain when like my room is a mess. So this is just like so important to me. It's like literally seven and I'm not hungry quite yet. So I think our next steps are going to be doing an everything shower, like face care, skin care, hair care, and then hopefully I can put on a set of press on nails because I know I keep mentioning it, but I just love having my nails done so badly. So step one before we can actually do like literally anything is to shower prep. Shower prep, I swear to you, is just as important as what you do in the shower. Always, 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 always brush your hair out before you shower. What Taylor Swift album are we feeling for shower? It is fall time, so that's giving like ever more red, but I'm also feeling tired, so I don't want to be sad. Always remove my makeup before I take a shower because I hate when I get out of the shower and I feel so clean and so good. And I look in the mirror and I have like raccoon eyes. I just like streaks of messed up makeup all over my face. I think I'm just gonna look up a playlist on Spotify because I don't think I can commit to one album right now. Honestly, if I could, I'd just listen to 1999 Taylor's version. But as I'm actively filming this, it's not out yet. I think it's like, it's Friday. Today's Monday. I have to wait like five more days to be blessed. Okay, I'm gonna go take a shower now. I'll meet you on the other side. And we're back, besties. For you, that was like two seconds. But for me, that was like 30 minutes. And now that we're done with the shower, we're going to do skincare and hair care. First of all, look at the nails! Okay, I've had this press on set since literally last Halloween. And I'm reusing them this year, and they're so freaking good. They just make me feel put together. 
Second of all, if you're looking for an orange nail polish, this is like so random. I feel like orange nail polishes are so hard to find for Halloween and for spooky season without literally looking like neon orange. And I know that by the time this video goes up, it's not going to be Halloween time anymore. But if you're looking for like a beautiful orangey color to use, because I use this on like my feet, not my fingers, obviously, highly, highly, highly recommend paparazzi this color is light it's beautiful it's shimmery it's sheer and it doesn't make you feel like a freaking neon jack-o-lantern when you use it it's so pretty and this is my go-to literally every october i've had this bottle for like two years now and i literally use this all october and november long because it is just like the perfect orange for fall i'm honestly getting so tired but i think our next step is going to be banana bread because i'm on i'm getting hungry again I just feel like some banana bread would hit tonight. Banana bread has been my go-to baking item of choice recently, and I found this recipe that I will link down below. It's literally a one bowl recipe, and it's so quick to make. I think even though the directions says like 30 minutes, it quite literally took me less than 15 to bake it last time, which was absolutely wild. But it's so good, so fast, so easy to clean up, and I've been seriously craving some. It is somehow literally almost 7 p.m., but I just took the banana bread out of the oven. It's literally looking so good. I cannot wait to eat this banana bread, read my book, and conk out for the night. I'm so tired right now. Also, can I please have some commotion for this baking dish? I got this from Home Goods, and it's literally a pumpkin baking dish moment, and it's just so freaking cute. And now every time I bake something, it has to be in this dish. Wow! Hi, besties. I think it is officially time. For me to go to bed. It's literally 11 o'clock. I just finished my banana bread and I feel like I'm falling asleep sitting up right now. I'm just so exhausted. So I'm going to go like brush my teeth and journal and just get ready for bed and go to bed. If you've made this far in today's video, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I've been very in and out with YouTube recently and I really want to get more consistent with it. So I hope, I hope that when you're seeing this video, that I'm starting to post regularly again. I've really missed YouTube. I love video production, so I'm really excited to get back into posting. But this is all just to say, I hope you're doing well. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know I've had fun tonight vlogging, and I hope to see you next Monday, because I post every Monday. Um, if you want to stay up to date with me, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, go follow me on Instagram. Here is my handle, as per usual. I'm much more active over there than I am on here. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day, amazing morning, amazing night, afternoon, whatever time it is. And hopefully I will see you next week. Bye.